and tan 11 pi by 3. To find this, we should follow this method C. In the denominator, we have 3. In the numerator, 11. Now you should check. 11 is close to which multiple of 3? What I mean is 11 and here you write multiples of 3 that is 9 and 12. Now 11 is close to which number? This is close to 12. So 11 should now be written as 12 minus 1. So this will become tan in place of 11 now I write 12 minus 1 pi by 3. This is your step 1. Next, tan. Now you should open, open the brackets. You get 12 pi minus 1 pi by 3. Now tan over here you should split the denominator in this way. That is 12 pi by 3 minus 1 pi by 3. Next, tan. Now here you should cancel 3 1s, 3 4s. So we get 4 pi minus this no change. Next, here we have pi. So tan is not going to change, it will remain tan. And inside we get this angle pi by 3. Now the question is will we get here plus or minus? To answer that you should look at the number before pi which is 4 and 4 is even and all the even multiples of pi they lie in either in the first or in the fourth quadrant. So now to select the quadrant we should look at this symbol. Here we have negative. That means angle lies in the fourth quadrant. And in the fourth quadrant tan is negative. So we should put negative. So negative tan pi by 3 is root 3. This is our answer.